Hey guys, Garrett here from iOS Pro today. I'm gonna to show you guys how to enable theater mode on any iPhone running iOS 16 today. So let's get started. Okay guys, so in order to enable theater mode on any iPhone running iOS 16 today is, first thing, I'm gonna be using my iPhone XR for this demo. Then go to Safari, then download this Siri shortcut called Theater Mode On or Off. Sorry, let me turn my brightness down. All right, that's better. So now click Get Shortcut. Then Add Shortcut. But there's actually a glitch where if you ask Siri to turn on the Theater Mode shortcut, she'll mispronounce it and treat the T R E like like T E R. So then it'll say Shortcut Not Found. So to fix this, just rename it up here. Then just rename the shortcut to theater was T-E-R. That will fix that. All right, so now to enable this, just say this. Run theater mode. Would you like theater mode on or off? Just like that. Now you can choose the option to turn on or off. I'll do on. Allow theater mode to display no. To say allow. Then it'll say this. Okay. Don't be a texture. Keep off your phone during the movie and enjoy. That's a funny message. So what you see here did that uh, it basically turned down the brightness, do not disturb is on, and low power mode is on. Those are basically the settings you use for a movie theater. It's pretty similar to the Apple Watch. So basically when you turn that on, it doesn't just dim the brightness on the watch, but it turns on the mute and prevents the screen from lighting up when notifications come in. So that's basically very similar. Let me just turn my watch's mode off here. Now to turn it off, just do this. Run theater mode. Would you like theater mode? Then tap off. And just like that, it's now Done. off. And now it'll say, hope you enjoy the movie. Have a good night. All right, so sorry about that. My brightness blasted. So to prevent the brightness from blasting near 100% after a movie, just go back into shortcuts. Go into the options key. Then go down to where it says, turn off low power mode and go down to where it says set brightness to, then change this down to 35% or 36, it doesn't really matter, right here. This will prevent the screen from blasting through the eyes We you turn off theater mode. All right, so a second way to do it is go to settings, accessibility, touch, back tap, and set the double tap to theater mode, just like that. Now when you do this, Double tap it, theater mode now activates. You can switch it on, just like that. And then, there, there we go, theater mode is now on. It basically takes the long, like, two minute process for like, or a minute process to like, turn down the brightness, low power mode, do not stir. It basically switches it into like a couple second process, like one, less than a minute process. And it does it all at once. I'll do it again, one, two. Then I'll do it off. So you guys see the op changes we made to the brightness code inside the shortcut prevented from blasting me in the eyes right away. Just like that. Now I'm going to do it again on my iPhone 11. J just to, as a recap. Let me turn my brightness down here. Get Click Get Shortcut. Add. Now I'm going to do the same thing up here. Rename this to Theater with R-E-E-R -E -E instead of R-E up here. Done. Now I'm going to change the set brightness to, after you turn it off, I'm going to set this down to 36%. Basically, because yeah, you your eyes have to have time to adjust after a movie. So if you turn it off and it blasts you in the eyes, it can really hurt your eyes if you're not expecting it. That's why it's said to that. Run theater mode. Would you like theater mode on? On. Allow. The Allow. And just That's like that. Done. Theater mode is now on. Do not disturb, low power mode, and the brightness has been all set for movie standards. The only thing you guys have to do is just mute your phone. That's the only thing you guys have to do. Like manually. Run theater mode. Would you like theater mode? And just like that, theater mode is now off. Just like that. So that is how you get theater mode on any iPhone running iOS 16 today. That's pretty much it for this video. If you liked the video, give this a video. Peace out.